The Pimax 8K Plus has just been announced in Berlin. And of course, the Pimax 8K M2 has just been shown in Berlin for the very first time. And now here on MRTV for the very first time, you will see the unboxing of the Pimax 8K M2 and the Pimax 5K Plus in its very special Berlin Meetup edition. And all of this goodness is coming up. Hi and welcome to MRTV. My name is Sebastian Ang. And if this is your first time here and you're just as excited about VR and AR as me, then subscribe now and click on the bell button so don't miss anything. The Pimax 8K M2 and the Pimax 5K Plus have just for the very first time been shown off in public at the Pimax Becker Meetup in Berlin. And I already have the devices here and I'm going to show you the unboxing now for the very, very first time. Now, for all of you who don't know yet, what is the Pimax 8K and the Pimax 5K Plus? Well, these are next generation VR headsets with a very wide field of view and very high resolution displays. They have been funded in a Kickstarter campaign last year where they had the most successful VR Kickstarter campaign ever, earning more than 4 million. And then the company also had a 5, 15 million investment. So that is really exciting. They wanted to deliver in general already, but we had lots of delays and uh, a long testing phase where I was one of the 10 testers who already had the Pimax 8K at home and well, we testers gave feedback for the engineers. So together we helped to improve the device. The Pimax 8K M2 is now the improved version, the result of this long testing phase. And the Pimax 5K Plus is a new version of the Pimax 5K, which has an improved display and which was first shown at the Pimax Becker meetup in Berlin. But now, I'm really excited to show you the very special Berlin edition that probably I'm the only one that owns this special edition. And I'm very excited about this very, very special unboxing of these two devices. So without further ado, here is the unboxing of the Pimax 8K M2 and the Pimax 5K Plus. And here it is. Have a look at this intricate flower design that we see at the front of this limited Berlin meetup edition. It is a very, very special bundle that we have here. And we even have this handle here to more easily transport this special edition around. And to even make it more authentic, they put some German text on top of it all so that you will know, hey, this is the Berlin special edition. From the handling, it feels really, really good. Let's have a look at the top here. Again, the handle, it is made of some kind of plastic-like material. Of course, again, to make the whole package lighter so you can easily transport it and show off that you got the Berlin special edition here of the Pimax 8K and 5K+. Plus. And again, super authentic, all the text is in German. So on top of this packaging, you will learn that this is made by recycled materials. So even you do something for the environment if you get the Berlin Meetup Edition of the Pimax 8K and the Pimax 5K+. Plus. And let me tell you a bit about how this whole thing feels in the hand. Well, it feels simply good. Again, the intricate flower design. Then here on the bottom right, we have this little logo, little. It's a supermarket chain here in Germany. So again, authenticity. They probably work together with them on the packaging. On the side, we have barcodes. So simply scan them and you will find out what is the number of your limited edition. Wonderful. I think that's a very nice touch. But now let's get to the unboxing of the device. So as you can tell, on three different locations, there is this transparent adhesive tape to hold everything together. And again, transparent. It means the company is transparent in all that they do. And I think that is a very nice symbolism here. So let me open up this adhesive tape, this transparent adhesive tape at these three locations. So here, number one number two here and it's a good feeling it's a really good feeling to open it up everything is really simple so they just make sure that you can easily get to the devices and now the magic moment the moment when you first open it and see the devices a very crucial moment in every unboxing and let's do it together here it is i mean beautiful 
simply beautiful and I don't even want to know what kind of work went into engineering that first moment when you opened the packaging. And now it's very simple for me to grab the first device and pull it out and have my first look at it. Do you see that? Do you see what kind of material they used here for that outer packaging? So there's an outer packaging around the actual device and you get a glimpse at those power adapters there. So it's some kind of transparent material which actually does reflect a bit your surroundings. So all taken into consideration, this is only a masterpiece of packaging. And I did have a first look here at the Pimax device. Now let's get out the other device. Bubble wrap, so nice. Here, this is the other packaging. I'm going to put it away, it can be reused and well, everybody will know that I got the Berlin limited edition, nice. But let's have a closer look now at this here, at the second device and interesting, they don't use the same transparent material like they did in the, in the other device, right? So this might symbolize the dualism between the Pimax 8K and the Pimax 5K Plus, genius. So there you have it, got them both out. But now let's really have a look and let's get it out of their bubble wrap here. So you have to unfold it several times. I suppose that is meant for, uh, for protection purposes. But then here it is, here you have the first clear look at what it seems is the Pimax 5K or 8K. There should be some kind of symbol and here I can tell, I can tell there is something. So yes, this is the Pimax 5K Plus. Let's have a closer look at the Pimax 5K Plus now. So here on the bottom you have a USB-C connector that is actually, well, for the modules they're gonna come, the smell module, the leap motion module, or any kind of other module that is gonna happen in the future. So the Pimax 5K Plus that I have here actually it looks exactly like the Pimax 8K M1 that I already have here since like three months and also just as the Pimax 8K M2. So from the outside, you can really tell. This is the cable that is coming out of the Pimax 5K Plus and the 8K M2 as well. And this cable does split up into a display port and USB. So no USB-C, no, this splits up to DisplayPort and the standard USB. And as you can tell, you can also exchange the face padding here. It's connected to the device via Velcro, so that is definitely very convenient. And here on the bottom right of the device, you will see the wheel for the IPD adjustment. Of course, really, really important. Now let's have a look at the cable. So the cable is quite long. I would say probably this is probably five meters or so, really long enough. And here it is, let's have a look. It does split up again in USB, the standard one, not the USB-C, and to display port. Unfortunately here, it's not really in focus <laughs> and yeah, takes tool R ah, here. Here we have it. In focus now, display port, standard size display port and standard USB. And here, here is the part where you actually input the power, the power adapter. Now let's get to the second device. And here for the second device, we have that semi-transparent bag and it has some kind of zip lock. So you can easily close it again and put it back. I think that is a truly nice touch. Removing it feels good, very satisfying and directly you're being greeted by these two power adapters which have been nicely put there. Let me put them aside for now and let's have a look at what should be the Pimax 8K M2. And once you put away the bubble wrap that you can actually keep and use for all kinds of other items, very well thought through, you will see the Pimax 8K M2 and also here we have that beautiful design and actually it is exactly the same as the Pimax 5K Plus. So again, the duality of the two systems. Actually, it's not only the duality of the two systems that could be meant here. It could also be the duality of East and West because of course, 
Pimax comes from China and this Berlin edition had been well delivered to me in Berlin and as you all know Berlin was also a divided city with East and West communism and democracy all in one city and I believe they have chosen Berlin for a reason. As you can tell I've just used the IPD adjustment it works fine so simply turn that wheel and the lenses will go closer together or wider apart. And have a look here at this hammer head design. So hammer as you all know is a tool which stands for power and heads normally contain brains so we all understand the symbolism here. So there you have it that was the unboxing of the Pimax 8K M2 and the Pimax 5K Plus in this very special Berlin Meetup Edition. I'm going to review these two devices now and of course I'm going to give them the Thoro MRTV review treatment and on the 16th of September you're going to be able to watch the full review here on MRTV and of course I'm going to answer the question which one is the device to go for the Pimax 8K or the Pimax 5K Plus if you're a backer and if you're not a backer is it worth it to order any of these devices I'm truly looking forward to tell you the answer to those questions. So why this unboxing of the Pimax 8K M2 and the Pimax 5K Plus in its broad edition? Well for fun because honestly I do deserve a little bit fun after this three month of hard testing and improving the device. But also I got quite a lot of questions from from all these backers that couldn't go to the meeting like where's the headphone jack, what kind of cable is being used and all of these questions and I think in this video I already do answer those questions but again the the headphone jack is is here Can you see that here this is the headphone jack it's on the left side of the device and that is very useful if you want to use your HTC Deluxe Audio Strap because as you know for the Pimax 8K M1 I'm um, using the Deluxe Audio Strap and I kind of attached it to the device and it did works really well. Then um, some other questions here on the bottom you have a USB-C connection and that that USB-C connection is being used for the modules like for the smell module or for the hand tracking module for the leap motion so that is a nice thing to have. Then on top here again we have the on and off button and we have the volume controls <clears throat> then here here we have the IPD adjustment manual IPD adjustments and those lenses will move according to you um, doing the adjustments here so again yeah for the cable you have seen it already but again why not show it to you again here it's display port and USB so that is fine and again here here's the connector for the power so I really hope that this was useful for you if yes I'd be happy if you give it a thumbs up and if you have not yet subscribed to this channel yeah you should absolutely do so so you won't miss my MRTV review of the Pimax 8K and the Pimax 5K Plus I'm looking forward to see you in the next episode.